How many people have you seen cooking a salad? Probably a lot, right? But hey, how many people have you seen cooking a salad shirt? Probably not a lot. You know why? Because cooking shirtless can be one of the most dangerous activities you can do. Cooking shirtless can be even more dangerous than a girl on her period who has not eaten breakfast yet. To prove my point, the place with the greatest number of shirtless cooks is Africa. And everyone knows that Africa is one of the most dangerous places on earth today. My name is Bruno Baba and today I'm going to show you how to safely and effectively cook shirtless. We're going to cook a spinach salad which is super nutritious and super delicious. To cook this salad you're going to need spinach, grapes, a six pack, uh, you're going to need cheese, you're going to need eggs, yeah you heard me right, you need eggs, so if you're a vegetarian get the out of here and you're gonna need oranges that's it and also you're gonna need a lot of love when doing it because cooking is all about passion and love and not starving first thing we need to do is wash the spinach it says here that this spinach is already triple washed but hey I don't trust anyone who has to wash spinach for a living I wouldn't triple wash it if I was them. The spinach is washed and on the plate. Now we have to cut the oranges so we put them on top. Now, real men never use knives to cut oranges. It's a sign of weakness. A real man uses his teeth to cut oranges until he has got no more teeth left inside his mouth. Oh, oh that this is bad. Ooh. Hard to be a real man. <laughs> right? Oh my god. Oh. The taste in my mouth is terrible. And I think I broke one. Let me just use the knife. I'm not a real man. <laughs> now, this orange was too big, so we're only gonna use half of it for our salad. The other half, just eat it raw. It's got the oranges. I recommend you to make the orange pieces as small as possible. Now it's time to put the grapes on our salad. Again, wash them first. I already did that. Because you don't want to trust anyone who washes grapes for a living. These things are used to make wine. So <laughs> those guys who work there are probably drunk already. It's time to cut the egg in small pieces. Again my friends, as small as possible. Cut in the middle and then one making a lot of noise. My neighbors complain a lot about the noise I make. Now it's time to put my favorite thing ever on the salad. Cheese. This is goat cheese. Celebrity goat cheese. And you guys say I'm not famous yet. This is the goat that made this cheese. Look at how cool she looked. That's how she looked before she she made this cheese before the cheese came out of her breasts. I almost said tits, but I can't say that. Or can you? I mean, I am saying it. I have to censor it. Cheese. This is blueberry vanilla cheese. It looks delicious. It's gonna be my first time having it, but uh, I can't have too much of it because, as you might know, cheese has a lot of fat. And uh, if you eat a lot of cheese, you're gonna lose this talking about my six pack. Good thing I have a scale here. I'm going to measure exactly how many calories I'm going to eat. The good thing is that the nutrition of the cheese is shown here. This cheese has 80 calories per 28 grams or one ounce. So I'm going to try and go with that. 80 calories are not that bad. Oops. 53 grams is a bit too much. Let me add some more here. This cheese looks oh my this cheese looks like an ice cream. <laughs> oh my god. 55. I'm gonna enjoy every piece of it. <laughs> That's so good, I make it 55. Fi ah. I'm gonna use my hands to crumble this amazing cheese over this salad and make the salad 10 times more delicious. 
you can use any kind of cheese guys but I really recommend goat cheese it's like it's so creamy but if you don't want to get fat just <laughs> eat feta cheese because I think that's the one with the least calories of all the cheeses oh my god oh my dios this is a miracle lick my hands now. The final step is adding some olive oil. Olive oil has a lot of fat but it's healthy fats. Now you mix everything up. As you might see I'm not the best cook because this plate is too small for everything I eat but now it's time for the master chef to enjoy his masterpiece. Maravilloso, so good, and I'm telling you, this salad wouldn't have been half as delicious if I would have prepared it wearing a shirt. It's only delicious because it was done shirt, and although, as you saw, it was dangerous, <laughs> it turned out good, you know. So cook shirtless. Make sure you're, you're alone in the house, okay? I mean, depending on how you look. <laughs> Guys, give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Now, let me enjoy myself, my masterpiece that I cook, working so hard, shirtless. Shirtless life is the best life.